William Henry Harrison was the ninth president of the United States, serving only for 32 days before his untimely death. Born in Virginia in 1773, Harrison grew up in a prominent political family and pursued a career in the military before entering politics. Harrison is most well known for his military career, particularly his victory over Tecumseh's forces at the Battle of Tippecanoe in 1811. He also served as the governor of Indiana Territory and later as a member of Congress. In 1840, Harrison ran for president as the Whig Party's nominee. He campaigned as a common man, emphasizing his military service and portraying himself as a farmer and a man of the people. His campaign slogan, Tippecanoe and Tyler II, referred to his victory at the Battle of Tippecanoe and his running mate, John Tyler. Despite concerns about his age and health, Harrison won the election by a large margin. However, his presidency was short-lived. Just 32 days after his inauguration, Harrison became ill with what is believed to have been pneumonia. He died on April 4, 1841, making him the first president to die in office. Despite his short time in office, Harrison's legacy has endured. He is remembered as a war hero and a symbol of the American spirit. His grandson, Benjamin Harrison, would go on to become the 23rd president of the United States.